How did a lost global civilization once cut solid stone with such ease and precision? Unimaginably large megalithic structures, laser-like cut stones, utilized within the baffling, polygonal masonry, not to mention the mystery surrounding the construction of the Great Pyramids. Many mysterious drilled stone cores can be found throughout Giza. These enigmatic tool marks can also be found at the incredibly ancient dolmen of Valkonsky in Russia, exposing the capabilities and clear technological prowess that this lost civilization, who we feel were possibly experiencing an ice age, had left in order to survive its fallout. Yet I digress. Discovered within Austria, we were initially presented with just these three images, two of the exterior, which, if one looks closely, not only displays the porthole of a hidden chamber hidden upon the side of a solid rock face, but that the surrounding rocks had also been cut and finished to an incredibly high standard somewhere in the very distant past. This indicated to us that this chamber that is not only reminiscent of the hypogeum in Malta, with the addition of the stone within the circular chamber, which we cannot avoid feeling, could have some form of connection to resonance creation, with erosion indicative of a site with an age similar to Cappadocia's ruins, but later revealed to have been, as we expected, but one chamber, in a maze akin to that of the underground city of Derinkuyu hidden within an Austrian book of antiquities, we discover a series of fortunately mapped solid stone-cut chambers which litter this enormous chunk of exposed bedrock. Clearly an astonishing prehistoric site, one cut by an incredibly capably, and we feel, clearly technologically advanced civilization. For why would a civilization with simple, primitive tools, such as those made of blunt or brittle stones, or soft, malleable metals, such as that of copper, go to such extremes in the creation of a maze of hidden chambers, each not only finished to an incredibly precise degree, but to have worked stones into unnatural shapes outside of these chambers, many serving no essential function as far as we can identify? Who created this prehistoric site found within the landscape of Austria? How old are the chambers? What technology or tools were utilized in the creation of such a magnificent ancient ruin? Or indeed that of the Volkonsky Dolmen, along with the many similarly drilled cores and their stone blocks found throughout Giza? Do all these pieces of evidence indicate the past existence of a lost civilization, one who possessed advanced stone-cutting technology? We find such possibilities highly compelling. <laughs>